In order to quantify this, we actually, while we're stretching it, take photos with a DSLR camera. And we analyze the photos uh, that we take. Uh, those are made up of um, a red, green, and a blue channel. And so by looking at the intensity of each of those channels, we can map the color change as it occurs. And so you'll notice that initially the color doesn't change very much until we get to about 80 or 90% strain, and then it begins to become colored. Um, and over this same period where it's not colored, <coughs> there's a resistance, which increases as strain goes up and the wire gets thinner. But throughout the entire colorless region, the wire is still conducted. <coughs> um, and failure usually happens somewhere between 160 200% strain. So you have this color change occurring prior to failure while the device is still functional to warn you, don't stretch it any further. <laughs> um, and so to try to make this like more user friendly, we decided to work on patterning in um, words into the material to actually tell you to stop pulling. Um, and so in order to do this, we took the same material, um, but we have this it, uh, inner layer that has spirochiram in it, surrounded by 